Hey Leia users, in this video tutorial we will walk you through how to edit the various components of your gallery section. So let's scroll down to it. And uh, this is the gallery that Leia chose for us. We have a little title. We have a number of categories, which I'll talk about in a second, and then a few photos. So right now there are three that are visible, photo one, photo four, and some random new photo that is placeholder worthy uh, that Leia just chose for us. Um, so the categories are a way for you to assign uh, various categories that users can filter on for your photos. So, you know, for example, if you were, um, you know, an app developer, for example, and sometimes you build mobile games, sometimes you build, um, you know, more professional commercial applications, sometimes you build apps that build websites, etc. Um, you could categorize the different photos that you have for those and then put them in here and allow the user to filter your, you know, your, your projects, your portfolio, you know, based on the type of work. So let's tap on all. And what this will do is it'll pull up all of our photos in our gallery. So the way you edit the actual photos in your gallery is a little bit different than the other sections. If you tap on one of the photos, it'll pull up our actual slideshow. So we can tap on the left and right icons to cycle through the slideshow. If we want to exit out of the slideshow, we tap the X in the top right there. And if we want to edit the photo, now's our time to do so. We just tap in the middle of it. And as you can see, it pulls up the edit element box where we can replace the image or pick a link that we want um, this photo to take us to. So again, you know, if we did have uh, this as a portfolio where these were links to individual apps or some sort of a project that we had somewhere else online, we could allow the user to click on this photo and be taken there. Um, you'll notice that when we click on right or left to cycle through an image or when we first have it pop up, we have the image category uh, option right here. So what you can do with this is create a new category to assign this image to. You can assign it to no category or you can pick one of the existing categories um, and make it so it will only show up when either all or that category is checked. Uh, right now it's on category like actually, I think it was category one. It could have been something else. Um, but anyhow, so you can check off which one you want. Um, if you wanted it to be no category, that means it will only show up when all is checked. So just like any other section in our page, down at the very bottom, you have the buttons to redesign the section. You have the buttons to change the background and add or remove elements. And as always, the best way to do these things is to tap on the toolbox icon and open up your desktop view. All right, so now we can see the entirety of our gallery section and we see all the different you know, um, categories up at the top. Um, so what we'll do first is do a redesign. All right, and as you can see, we have a different set of um, uh, styles uh, for, our, for our gallery and we click it again, we can see some more um, and we can again just you know, continue to do this as many times as we want to. If we wanted to remove those bottom two photos, let's say we just didn't like the fact that there were placeholders there. Obviously, we could have changed these to other photos if we had them. But again, you tap the plus and the minus buttons, um, you know, to make those go away. Um, something that we didn't do is we can change the text of the categories. So obviously, by default, there's category one, category two, and category three. Um, but if we go back to mobile and scroll back down. Uh, let's say we wanted to rename category one to something else. You just hit the edit text button, tap on it, and then you can change it to, let's say, um, mobile apps, right? Um, so, so now we have, you know, mobile apps. Actually, I probably should have done something more related to coffee, but you get the picture. Anyway, that's all really, we really wanted to go into for the, um, the gallery section. Um, if you have any other further questions, please feel free to reach out to us at heylea.com slash contact and uh, we will get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you.